Hi guys, this is Matthias, and here is the second part of this video, this is the tutorial part. So I will show you step by step how to play this song, and the solo as well. If you would like to jump any part of this song, you can use the time codes down the description, and by clicking that, it's really easy to jump, go back to the play along track after you learn the song, or every part you can easily jump. Let's zoom in, let's start. So we will have three different chord progression in this song. Let me start with the intro. In the intro we have three different chords. A minor is the first chord. G major is the second chord. You can play any kinds of G. So with the open B string you can play this G and this G as well. You can, you can play a G bar chord as well if you would like to but this is the easier way to play the G this is why I usually uh, use this one and it's really easy to change the next chord which is a C major chord so the third chord in the intro and the verse will be the same um, is C major so A minor G major C major two bars so the rhythm is really easy in the intro because you just have to put down every first beat every chord so one two three four one two three four one two three four two two three four one two three four three four one two three four two two three four so this is the this is the intro the next part is the first verse. Uh, there is no strumming in this part, uh, so this is why it will be the same. So, so the chords are the same. A minor, G major, C major, and the rhythm as well. One, two, three, four, two, three, four, three, three, four, 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 three, four, one, two, three, four, G. C, T, T, T. Okay, so actually that's it. It's really easy, the intro and the verse. In the pre-chorus, um, we, have, we have one new chord, which is D minor. It goes like this. The second chord in the pre-chorus is C major. Three chords in the pre-chorus. D minor, C major, and G major. So the rhythm will be the same as um, in the intro. So one, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, three, four, G. Here is the whole pre-chorus. One, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, four, G, two, three, four. This is the first pre-chorus. Let's jump to the next part, which is the first chorus, and here we will have a strumming pattern. So in this part of the song, we will need four chords. The first one is F major chord, which is a bar chord. You can play any kinds of F chord. So if, if the, the bar, to play a bar, it's hard for you. You can use, you can use F slash C, which goes like this. Or you can play the, the small bar F like this. So it will sound the same. So you can use any kinds of F chord. So first chord F, second chord in the chorus is C, 
third chord is A minor, and finally we have a G chord. Okay, here is the strumming pattern. Okay, a little bit slower. Down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. So this is the first chorus. In the second verse, we have a strumming pattern, which is the same strumming pattern what we have in the chorus. So. lower a little bit. So three chords, A minor, G major, C major in the verse, in the second verse. So down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 So here is the second verse and, um, and the next part is the second pre-chorus. In the second pre-chorus, the chords are the same. D minor, C major, D minor, C major, D minor, C major, and G. And here we have one new chord and uh, this is a E major chord. And with this chord, we will go to the to the next chorus. Down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. And this F chord is the first chord of the next chorus. Slower a little bit. Down, down, down. Down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up, G, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up. Okay, let's jump to the next new part, which is the guitar solo part. If you would like to download the tabs for the solo and the backing track, you can download from my Patreon page. And by doing this, you can support my work, what I really appreciate. So let's jump into the solo first bar. This is the first bar. The first note is, is the 10th fret of on the, on the B string. So the first note is on the B string, third finger. Second note as well. The third note is the eighth fret of the on the B string. So two, three, four. Here we are, and the next note is the eighth fret on the high E string. So, so second bar, first finger, eighth fret, B string. The second note, the same fret on the high E string. Next note, tenth fret on the high E string. So. Here is a little trick. You can you can bend the string a little bit or slide up a little bit. It will sound almost the same. I just slide up a little bit from the tenth fret of the high E string. So eighth fret B string, eighth fret E string, tenth fret of the high E string, and after I pick again the tenth fret and slide up, and the last two notes in the in the second bar is 7th fret high E string 
8th fret high E string with my first and the second finger. So let's jump to the next bar. The first note is on the B string, 10th fret, you have to pick three times. The next note is 8th fret on the B string, 1st finger. And the next one is in the same fret on the high E string. So, and 3rd uh, finger, 1st finger and 2nd finger on the high E string. The next note is 8th fret on the B string, 1st finger. The next note is 8th fret on the high E string and 10th fret of the high E string. And here I slide up again or you can blend as well if you would like to. So here is the third bar. Let's play again. One, two, three, four. Fourth bar. First note, third finger is 12th fret high E string. Two times. The next note, 10th fret high E string, first finger, and 12th fret B string, third finger. And uh, the next four notes will be faster a little bit. 12th fret B string, 13th fret on the B string and the pinky, 10th fret B string and uh, 12th fret on the G string. So I pick these notes like this, down, up, down, up. So let me play the fourth bar. The next bar. First note um, in the fifth bar is A note on the B string 10th fret first finger. Four times. After we have a G note, B string, 8th fret, 1st finger. So, here, next note, G string, 9th fret, 2nd finger. So, let's jump to the 6th bar. We have an E note on the G string, 9th fret, 3 times, first of all. After we have five times the same note, second finger, and the next, the last two notes in this bar is seventh fret on the G string, first finger. So let's play the sixth bar. Two, three, four. This is the sixth bar. And on the last bar, we have only three notes. D string, 9th fret. After 10th fret with the pinky, D string. And first finger, 7th fret on the D string. This is how it goes. Let's listen once again the whole solo. This is the whole 
song. I hope you found this video useful. If you have any questions, just leave a comment below. I try to answer all of them. And don't forget that Skype lessons also available. You can download the tabs and the play along track from my Patreon page. And if you like this video, share with your friend, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. See you next time. Bye.